हरिओ माई नेम इज डॉक्टर अभिषेक सिंह चिटनेस एंड आई लिव इन बॉस्टन मैसेच्यूसेट्स टूडे आई वॉन्ट टू शेयर एन अनुभव दैट इज क्लोजली रिलेटेड टू माई करियर इन फैक्ट आई वॉन्ट टू शेयर अ सीरीज ऑफ अनुभव दैट हैव अनफोल्डेड आफ्टर आवर विजिट टू इंडिया इन डिसम्बर ऑफ ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू every time when we have visited india we have made it a point that we visit hari gurugram and happy home so this time as well when we were visiting happy home to meet dada i was thinking how am i going to introduce ourselves to dada how is dada going to recognize us amongst so many shraddhawans and with this thought Uh, my family consisting of my wife madhura veera and my daughter ananya veera and myself entered dada's clinic and i started with uh, the introductions to that dada warmly smiled and said you already knows who we were here i am reminded about the super memory that dada has when we were discussing dada mentioned to me that i perform lalita ambika puja which we did and here i want to emphasize lalita ambika pujan because we had a transcendent experience performing that pujan it was a divine experience out of this world atmosphere when we were performing the pujan we felt as if moti ai herself maisha surmardini ai herself was with us during the entire ceremony after the pujan was performed we were left with positivity and divine energy at hari guru gram we got the opportunity to meet bapu and in fact bapu held my hand in his and that left me with an overwhelming sense of assurance that everything now was going to be nath somewhere and for my best later we returned to boston since this is my work related anubhav i would like to mention that i have my formal training my phd in health outcomes research and policy and at that time i worked as a director in a renowned pharmaceutical company in boston my role involved research activities that i had to present in conferences as poster presentations podium presentations and write manuscripts research articles i had i have been in this field now for about 15 years and i have always aimed for getting the top recognition awards when i'm presenting my research at conferences it was only once that also 11 years back that i had received the top recognition award however this time it was different with all the positivity and blessings from bapu in march when i was attending a conference and presenting my poster my poster received the gold medal award it did not stop here in may i had presented three more posters and all three posters got some kind of recognition or the other one of them was recognized as impactful research and the other two were selected as finalist not only that amongst those that were selected for finalist one of them was recognized as the best research poster giving me that top recognition and external visibility while all this was happening and i was getting external recognition internally within the company as well i was gaining that visibility and recognition amongst the leadership i was getting several accolades and was uh, getting big recognition awards as well but as we know uh, corporate industry is so unpredictable at one instant you are at the pinnacle of success and the next you are counted amongst those who are going to be facing layoffs and exactly that happened to me our company had filed for a drug approval which was denied 
and I was working on that drug. The company had announced that there were going to be 25% of employees that were going to be laid off and I was going to be one amongst them. When such news are uh, given out, it is usually that the HR would hold a brief call and the employee has to depart from the organization the same day. That is in general rule. And all my colleagues who got this news, they had to depart the same day. But now see how Bapu took care of me during this time of adversity. Everyone else except me. I was given an exception saying that you have to hand over the projects that I was working on to someone else. And for that, I was given about six weeks before I could separate from the company. All my projects had already been cancelled. I did not have any projects in hand that I had to hand over. But still I was given this grace period of one and a half month. And I believe this is all Bapu's Krupa only that I was given this one and a half month where I could find job. But when we were given this news, Madhura Veera and I were in total shock and dismay. I couldn't believe that the company had decided to let me go. It was very difficult time. But once we recovered from this news after a few days, I started to apply vigorously. Now look at the events that had happened in the past. Bapu made sure that I get the success at the right time, had it been that I would have received this award recognitions five years back and this event had happened now, it wouldn't have had that impact that it was having now because this was very recent experience. Here I had heard stories that people after losing their jobs, it's difficult to find jobs for six months, 12 months. And the job that you get may not be what you are aiming for. But here, when I started applying, I was getting interview calls and the recent experiences were gaining attention very quickly. I was moving into the next stages of interview and I was quickly into the final stages of interview for two companies. It was September by now. And a series of interviews were planned for a day that coincided with the arrival of Ganpati Bappa. So here in our Boston home, we celebrate Ganpati Bappa for five days. And it gets pretty busy here because we live in a close-knit Indian community where our neighbors, our friends visit us. We visit them. A lot of lunches, dinners are planned. And sometimes it gets very hectic given the limited help that we get here in the US. But again, Bapu took care of this for me as well. Suddenly the weather conditions here changed such that all the events had to be rescheduled. The events were rescheduled such that the day when I had my series of interviews, it was kept free of all the events. No events were planned on that day. Bapu made sure that I had no distractions on that day when my interviews were scheduled. Eventually, the interviews really went well. And with the blessings of Ganpati Bappa and Bapu's love, before the Vigna Arta could leave our home, I had received a job offer from one company and within next two days, I had another job offer in my hand. Ultimately, I accepted the one that was better aligned with my career growth. And all of these events unfolded before the last day of my previous company. When I look at this today in retrospect, what I see is life is full of ups and downs. But my Bapu made sure that he guided me towards success at the right time, made sure that I had his support. He orchestrated the events 
such that I get his support, love and the burden feels really lighter for me. I am khub khub ambadnya to you Baku for the love, caring and making sure that this adversity was not a punishment for me but as an opportunity for my growth and learning. Haryo Shriram Ambadnya Nathasambhe Nathasambhe Nathasambhe